We're going to go ahead and show you what went on in round number one as we get set for round number two. And we're going to start with Chris Demke, who was supposed to take on the number 12 qualifier. He didn't show up, but Demke made a thunderous run right here. Jerry Madden in the Keen right car running off that number one qualifying spot. You have a buy run, so you can test if you want, or you can run for low ET. And they went for low ET. That's a solid race car right now. They are the part of beat going into eliminations today. Take a look at that time. 531, 270 miles an hour. Low ET top speed of the weekend thus far. Then we got Joey Severance taking on one of the new kids on the block, Kyle Rizzoli. Kyle, another one of the second generation racers, as is Joey Severance. You've got the injected car making just his second start with Kyle Rizzoli. Dad Jim helping out. We'll talk more about him in just a little bit. Even with the cylinder out, he's going to be able to run down Joey, who had some problems. Pop the blower at the end of the racetrack. Rizzoli sailing on. Shadows of beautiful Mount Rainier. Here's the ladder for top alcohol dragster presented by Lucas Swell. But Chris Demke, Mike Austin, the winner there, will get a free pass into the finals today due to the short field. Field. Meanwhile, over on the other side of the ladder, the drivers highlighted Sean Cowie, Mark Niver. They will pick their lanes in round number two. First.